Hello, in this video I'll show you how to start a brand new Revit project in Revit 2012. Uh, for the most part, most of the versions are pretty much the same, uh, but I am using Revit 2012. We're going to hit new, and you will be prompted by this screen, which will be on level 1. Uh, these little markers you'll see here uh, are the elevation markers, which give you the elevations of your building on your site so you'd want to build within this space if your building is a little bit larger uh, you could simply move those out with the move tool once you have selected uh, this marker and you can move it as far back as you want and you can see I just done that so what we're going to do now is what you would want to do in every single project uh, you want to go into your elevations whichever one you pick uh, they're all perfectly fine and you'll see that you have level 1 and level 2 um, which is fine in most cases where you have a single story house that does not go into the basement or it doesn't exceed the first level so you will have your ground floor and your roof in this case we do want to have another floor and also a floor underneath so we're gonna go into structure and you'll see under structure you see level once you click this it will prompt you to start a new level so you want to go all the way to the end point on the left hand side and from there you want to go up don't click just go up have it lock and then decide on how high you want to go up let's go 10 feet click and extend that all the way to the end and when you come to the end it will lock into place you, you see it, it clicks so you click that there and now you have level three and let's create one more we're gonna go up um, let's make this one also 10 and here we go now now we're gonna go into renaming these floors uh, this is gonna be our basement yes and we're gonna create this basement let's say nine feet underground there you go and that has moved <clears throat> this is going to be our entry level and yes you would like to change your name as you can see it also shows up in your project browser we're going to change this to zero this is going to be our level one yes let's make this let's make a 10 and this will be our roof and let's add a little bit more space on the second level whoops uh, one mistake so here we have it this is a 12 foot difference between level 1 and 2. So now that we have done this, uh, you are ready to begin your project and everything is named. And we're going to go on to the next video. So check and see the next video when we're going to put in our exterior walls.